Founder chair that yeah. we found on the side of the road. Yeah, all the your residents get rid of their good stuff. Oh, I know. <laughs> that way we don't have to pay sixty dollars or whatever it costs these days to uh, do it. So when I do puppy exam, I grab a puppy okay. and I put her back up. Okay. <laughs> so she was a little dramatic before. You can drop the lace the first time because she does not like her her toes touched. No, she doesn't like to be tired at all. You should see when I try to brush her. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Yes, we do that. Oh, it's a good baggie. It's when she does something good. <laughs> and if she nibbles on me, I'll go. Yeah. She seems to be somewhat empathetic. <laughs> so we call this chubby exam. Yeah. And so why do we do this? To get her used to handling and grooming. Handle and grooming. <laughs>
So they never have, you know, it's funny, when I'm upstairs eating, yes. you know, they'll look at me and they'll be like, she's not going to do the same thing. You run downstairs. Oh, my God. Yeah. Right. <laughs> Yeah. Yeah. Look at those ears. Oh, I see 
activity. It's usually a very fast easy to reach the act of the Yeah, that's a, I can do that on my it's a great time to do it. Look at those teeth. Oh, they are <laughs> pretty pointy. I keep waiting for one of those teeth to come fly out into my living room. They usually uh yes. swallow do you do that? Yeah, yeah. I mean you might find one yeah. that they usually swallow, but then you'll notice that there's something missing. Right, right? Well, they smoke through pretty quickly to the adult tape. I love that belly thing. You can tell me you love this. Yes. We friends, we do this, don't we? We kind of like the belly rub. <laughs> what I've really been surprised at is in the morning when we put her up in the bed, that she doesn't go crazy, like jumping and yeah. It takes her 30 seconds to just lay down. Yeah. And she's really good. She's, you know. Watch out, she fits. She got a leash. Oh. There you go. She's going to have another one too. My, uh, my, one of my private lessons, they have a pre existing condition, so they've been afraid to come back in. They're going to bring their dog to, uh, uh, to the baby training. Oh, good. Oh, wow. Cooper. Um, so they'll have three puppies. Oh, nice. Yeah. So these people, they're afraid to come out because of the virus? Yeah, well, she, uh, uh, the owner has a pre existing condition. Oh, my husband does too. Yeah. That's why he gets nervous. It's funny because Steve Foster comes over and doesn't work at our house. Yeah. He was there, I guess it was, was it Easter Sunday that he came over? And he starts telling me how he's been with his daughter every day for a month and she has the virus. And I'm like, ah, uh, I don't know. It made me really nervous. Yeah. Because my husband definitely, he has, he's had lung surgery, cancer, yeah. he has diabetes, yeah. and, oh, he has every pre existing. So I went in and I said to Greg, I said, don't be anything to Steve, but he just told me this. I don't want you to go out there and be shaking his yeah. hand or anything. And he always usually wears, we usually wear a mask and yeah. when people are over there. But, oh my God, I was upset. I was like, uh, you should have told us that before. Like, yeah. <laughs> yeah. It's scary. It is scary. It's just like it's a minuscule particle. It is scary. It's like, you know, we're good. When I go to the, well, my daughter now will not be able to go to the supermarket. So. Um, she she lives in Capital. She gets our groceries and brings them to us once a week or every ten days. Yeah. And we always wear a mask. I always wear gloves when I go to the post office. And if I do go to Hannaford for anything small, I do. I wear a mask. I wear the gloves. I wash my hands a million times a day. I keep hand sanitizer in the car. Yeah. So I think we're really good, you know. But you have to be. You can't fool around, you know. Thanks, people. Just don't forget she's supposed to be on her back. I know. Oh, yeah. I know she's unhappy over there. I know. I know. Oh, my God. I'm sorry. I know. I know. Oh, don't fight me. Get that on your back. Like a good girl. Like this. You know. You don't want to be on your back, do you? No. Jeez, what are you doing to me? Who do you want? Do you want to try? I'm supposed to show her this. This was our little secret. I know. I know. <laughs> I know. You're so soft. 
up to you is air. It's air. Yeah. You're going to have to get used to getting brushed because you're looking kind of ragged. Chase we'll, we'll take the uh, brushes off. We don't, I don't have the right brush for this for you. Yeah. If you want to bring yours, I can. What kind of a brush is the best to use? I have the one with the wire ones. The wire. I have one that has like teeth on it. Like, that's not right. It might be. We'll bring it. Okay. Um, and when I brush it with it, I get a little bit of a fur yeah. that comes with it. Yeah. Um, but Chewy always looks so beautiful and brushed. <laughs> How does he do it? I don't think he is. <laughs> not? Why is it? So. Does she think it's just the difference in her texture? Yeah. Because hers is a little more maybe curly or whatever yeah. you want to call it, you know? He looks like, he almost looks like a Bichon. Yes, so he does. Yeah. I think, oh, no. Yeah, but that's, I would go no longer than 15 minutes. And if I notice that she gets kind of like, 
black towards the end and yeah. a little bit shorter. Right? Yeah. So, okay. All right. So that's more of a place, except for sit on the ground. Right. Right. Yes. Right. <laughs> well, that'll be our big one. Yeah. Okay. Yeah. 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 So yeah, the good thing with puppies is it doesn't need to be long. I usually spread it through the day. Right. Exactly. Which is nice.